Hello, this is Space News with Julia. The US Space Force has postponed a multi spacecraft mission that was booked to fly on a United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket in April. Moving a redo of a test flight for Boeing Starliner crew capsule to the front of the line on United Launch Alliance launch schedule. The Starliner test flight, delayed from last August, was tentatively scheduled to launch from Cape Canaveral on May 20. Boeing's Starliner team at Kennedy Space Center is ready in the crew Raider spacecraft for a launch opportunity in May. A mission that now becomes the next flight on ULA's Atlas V scheduler. The Starliner mission is a redo of an unpiloted test flight in December 2019 cut short by software problems. The software issues prevented the spacecraft from docking with the International Space Station. After several hardware and software changes, Boeing readied for second attempt at the Starliner's orbital flight test mission last August. The spacecraft was rolled to the launch pad at Cape Canaveral atop its Atlas V rocket, but test revealed stuck valves in the Starliner's propulsion system. Boeing and NASA, which manages the Starliner commercial crew contract, agreed to remove the Starliner from the Atlas V rocket and postpone the mission to investigate the valve problem. The first coming OFT-2 mission will fly with a new service model, one originally assigned to the first Starliner mission with astronauts. Boeing said the Starliner team designed a new Perjan system. If successful, the OFT-2 mission will pave the way for Starliner's crew flight test which will carry a team of three NASA astronauts to the space station. That will ultimately lead to operational crew rotation flights on the Starliner spacecraft, akin to SpaceX Crew Dragon missions to the space station, giving NASA two US vehicles capable of ferrying astronauts to and from the orbiting research complex. Space Daily News, stay tuned with us, don't forget to subscribe!